your belief from having done the research, from having spent time at the Roosevelt Library, from having read the thousands of letters that Lorena yeah. Hickok left for all of us to read long after she's gone, you have no question about what this relationship was. Well, I don't. I mean, I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm a grown woman, and I know what love looks like. Right. And I know that if you write to somebody, darling, it broke my heart when I spoke to you last night on the telephone, and I could not say to you, I love you and I adore you the way I always do at the end of our conversations, because little Jimmy was standing next to me. I think to myself, that is not something I right. would write to a pal. Right. Or I want to kiss you on, there's a, a, a line that I thought was so great about, I want to kiss you on the southwest corner of I your, long to kiss you on the southeast corner southeast of your corner lips of your and lips. lie beside you. And I thought, again, right. not what I've written what to am a I, pal. What am I not understanding about this? Exactly right. Yeah. And so the idea that yeah. people were hinting around, and there were rumors after the letters emerged, which was in the late 70s, I kept thinking, how, how, what? What part of what, this what, don't you get? Right, which, which, which word? Lips you don't understand? Corner right. you don't southeast? understand? Yeah. Maybe it's southeast. Maybe it's southeast right, really, exactly. th really through them. So, so let's go and do the Hick story for the benefit of people who have not yet read the book. So uh, born in Wisconsin, grew up in the Dakotas in South, South Dakota. Dakota. Um, became, and, and difficult early childhood, right? Uh, uh, upbringing, difficult yeah. circumstances. Um, becomes a reporter and is working for the Associated Press in the White House when uh, when she and Eleanor come well, to be acquainted. Well, she's actually covering Eleanor Cover, as, covering as Eleanor. a possible first lady when right. Franklin is governor of New York State. Pardon me, and, right, it, was, it was prior to running. Right? Yes, yes. And she has just come off the Lindbergh baby kidnapping and been a top reporter for that. Right. And is frustrated because she sees a fair amount of corruption and malfeasance on the part of the police and right. the FBI. And finally her editor says, you, you got to stop with this. Why don't you go cover Eleanor Roosevelt? The worst thing that'll happen is you'll be bored. And she goes <laughs> and um, and she meets her and yeah. they really hit it off. They are, their, their values are very similar politically. And I think they were really charmed by each other.